Hello, this is Dr. Heath Van Horn. I'm here to talk to you a little bit about the crossword and word searches that are available for each chapter. There are a lot of specialty terms used in IT, and to memorize those terms can be quite daunting. So what I've done is I've created crosswords and word searches for you to use to help you memorize those terms. These are not graded activities. You can take them as many times as you want to help you learn the terminologies. So to use the crossword, what you would do is you click on it, and you can see I've been practicing videos because I got lots of them in there going on. And we can look at the crossword and we can say, hey, what do we want to do? So we look for two across, and it says a complete power failure. That would be blackout, and it fills it in. And as you complete these, um, you can practice how well you know the definitions and the terminology. When you're done and you want to um, uh, Here's one device that stores an electronic charge that would be a capacitor. If you spell it wrong or something, it'll give you an error. Let's do this one. This one should have an error. So if we do uh, Bobby, we'll just throw a word in there. It says, nope, it's going to contain eight letters. Okay, Bobby Arena. Okay, and it still puts it in there and overwrites, but you can tell it's not right. And then when you do check crossword, it will tell you, hey, you got this one right, and you got that letter right. So um, that's how that works. If you hit end the game, it'll give you a score. And then you can click up here where it says new game, and it'll give you a completely new crossword puzzle to attempt. So that can be quite fun. If you want to print them, you can click on print and it'll print the crossword puzzle so that way you can do that as well. But it's a good way of memorizing terms and getting used to um, the various information that you have in IT. So if you don't like crosswords though, you can do the word search instead. So if you do a word search, And there are notes here that there are some issues with. So you can read the notes for each game. But you can attempt the game now. And it says complete power failure. Well, we know what that one is. We just had that. So blackout. And there it shows up in the word search. It says an under voltage that lasts seconds. A device that stores an electric charge. So as you do this, you can see that there's lots of words in this word search. So that way, if you might know the word, you can come up here and look for it. And then you can answer the question. And that's all there is to it. Again, this is the same thing. You can hit end of game. Or you can print. And it gives you a printout. So that way you can do this anywhere you want. So it, it can be, it's a lot more interesting than just making up a bunch of flashcards. Again, this is not graded. This is here for your own uh, ability to help memorize the terms that you need. So that way you can uh, get better at those terms. And that's the end of that. If you have any questions, please let me know. I am on Slack. Uh, from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. most days, and then a little bit at night before I go to bed. Um, I will Zoom one-on-one -on -one with you to offer tutoring or answer questions or anything you need, just so that way you can succeed at this class. This is Dr. Heath Van Horn, signing out.